This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Orlando. There's a promising new vaccine in the pipeline for smokers. Research has shown one year after getting the vaccine, 16% of people had quit smoking, as compared to 6% of those who received placebo. The vaccine is an antibody that binds to nicotine, forming a complex that is too large to cross the blood-brain barrier, thus preventing the stimulation of brain cells. From Washington, one of Walmart's top Christmas toys, Aquadots, is being recalled due to contamination with a chemical that converts into the date rape drug GHB. Many children worldwide are getting sick from ingesting these Chinese-made toys, exhibiting symptoms such as nausea, dizziness, seizures, and loss of consciousness. If you own Aquadots, also called Bindi's Beans, you should throw them away. From Oxford, using an oral contraceptive raises the risk for cervical cancer. An analysis of 24 studies shows a two-fold higher risk in those who use the pill for over five years. Those who stopped use for more than 10 years had no higher risk than those who had never used oral contraceptives. And finally, back to Orlando, which of these popular diets is the most heart-friendly? Ornish, South Beach, or Atkins. The three diets vary by amount of fat. Atkins has 50%, South Beach has 30%, and the Ornish diet has 10%. The answer, the Ornish and South Beach diets lowered LDL cholesterol by 10%, while the high-fat Atkins diet raised it by 7%. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.